At the start of the new school year, Heritage High School students will be welcomed back with a new football field and new lighting. But neighbors living next to the high school say the new lights could invite all sorts of problems into the neighborhood. Denver 7's Jessica Porter spoke to homeowners who feel left in the dark. We feel that the neighborhood's been transformed to a nice, sleepy little neighborhood into something right next to a stadium. It's not a stadium, but Heritage High School's athletics field is improving, along with several other schools, thanks to a $298 million bond measure residents voted for. We were in favor of the upgrades in general. Uh, the bond n never in detail to this extent mentioned this type of, of addition of lighting. Littleton Public Schools recently upgraded the field to turf and added lighting for the first time. That pole is actually on the far side of the football field, although it kind of dominates the skyline. The lights haven't even been turned on yet, but residents held a meeting to talk about the eyesore, traffic and their property values. Now the field could be heavily used. Uh, clear up to 10 o'clock at night and this street not only has a lot of reti retirees and elderly people but it has a lot of young children that are going to be trying to go to bed. Littleton Public Schools says they recently made a change and high school students start and end their day an hour later. Well that means after school activities start later as well. They said the lighting is a safety issue and it cannot be changed. The field doesn't have bleachers or a sound system and the new lights are designed not to impact surrounding areas. The district says they have rented out their fields for years to groups like soccer clubs to pay for upkeep. But news of that makes residents uneasy. We're going to come in our backyard. I mean, the field is right in some of us, right in the backyard. You're going to have, have people you don't know who they are. You don't know where they come from. I mean, it's a matter of safety. Neighbors say they love the school district and many of their kids play football on the very field in question, but they are considering legal action to have the lights removed. Jessica Porter, Denver 7.